I feel tired all the time with some muscle aches too. I even feel down emotionally, which isn't like me. Those symptoms could be linked to many things, but they actually might be related to low vitamin D levels. Vitamin D? Isn't that the sunshine vitamins? What exactly does it do? Yes, vitamin D is often called the sunshine vitamin because most of vitamin D is made when UVB rays from the sun falls on your skin. The vitamin D is then activated by your liver and kidneys. It helps your body absorb calcium, which is crucial for bone health, and it supports your immune system, mood, and muscle function. Okay, that actually makes sense. So how much vitamin D should I be getting? Vitamin D is measured in micrograms. The amount you need depends on the age and the stage of life. Infants to adults from 1 to 50 need about 5 micrograms per day. Pregnant and breastfeeding people need about 10 micrograms a day. Adults from 51 to 70 need about 10 micrograms a day. This is sometimes written as 400 international units. Older adults from 70 and above need about 15 micrograms a day. If you don't have enough vitamin D in your body, it's called vitamin D deficiency. So what happens if I don't get enough? If you don't have enough vitamin D, you may not notice any symptoms at first. But if it's severe, you may get aches, cramps, and pain in your muscles. An ongoing lack of vitamin D can increase your risk of weak, brittle bones and osteoporosis. Okay, now I'm worried. I do work indoors all day and I don't get out in the sun much. Don't worry, there are a few easy ways to boost your vitamin D levels. Number one, get safe sun exposure. Most people in New Zealand get enough vitamin D in the summer months because we have a lot of UVB exposure. It takes between about 6 minutes for a fair-skinned person in the north and 20 minutes for a dark-skinned person in the south with the sun on your face, hands and lower arms to get enough vitamin D for the day. UVB does not get through glass, so the sun needs to fall directly on your skin, not through a window. Vitamin D is stored in your body for up to 2 months, so your summer stores will get you part way through winter too. In winter, it could take more than an hour of sun exposure to get enough vitamin D for your daily needs. Number 2. Eat food rich in vitamin D such as oily fish like salmon, mackerel and sardines, full fat milk, butter and egg yolk. Number 3. Consider supplements. If you are not getting enough from food or sun, take vitamin D supplements. 10 micrograms a day will be enough for most people. Don't take more than 100 micrograms or 4,000 international units of vitamin D a day, as this could be harmful. Should I get my vitamin D levels tested? Yes, it's a simple blood test. Let's get that test and get you feeling better. That was so helpful. Follow Selena.